This is neither the time or place for such behavior. Like, sit your ass the fuck down. I believe that what Sir Integra is trying to say is that we must all be expected to fend for ourselves when the time comes. Is that correct? Yes, sir. And they're ghouls, aren't they? Bruh, they're nut all. up. Your standing orders will be followed to the letter. I promise that not one of these villains will ever see the light of day again. Ooh. Now, with your permission, sir, I believe it's time I gave these young people a proper lesson in violence. <laughs> Please do. Sorry, that's not what you want. You were about to get dealt with, sir. I know you're in here. Even when you're hiding, I can feel your presence. Why on earth would I hide? Exactly. Don't dare mistake my patience for cowardice. Mm. Honestly, I was starting to get a bit bored waiting for you. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Alucard. My name is Luke Valentine. Cool. I'm a really big fan of your work. Okay. Hmm. My name is Walter Dolmays. Butler to the Helsing family, and former master vampire hunter. Fire! Oh. Oh. Bit on the slow side, aren't they? After all, a ghoul is just a ghoul. In theory, threatening, certainly tenacious. But honestly, they're quite a distance from indestructible or invincible. <laughs> Miss Victoria, now would be a good time for some support. That is a big fucking gun. Right. Second volley. Fire an incendiary round with the BT fuse straight through the center ranks. Yes, sir! That barrel is ridiculous. Oh, fuck you! Y'all better move out of the way! I'm starting to feel my age. You're not the only one in charge here. Who else? <laughs> wow, you're quick. Kill him. Right now, Big Brother Valentine is downstairs beating Alucard into a carpet stain. <laughs> a monster whose powers radiate with a darkness that casts a shadow on darkness itself. Finally, I get to know once and for all if there's anything more to you than rumor. Hmm. Huh. When I was human, I feared you. The stories, anyway. And when I gave up being human, when I became this, I began to admire you. Sir. You, the first great pioneer of immortality. No just to let what you know. No matter what the rest of us do, really, we're all just chasing your shadow. Hmm. There are eight other episodes. That's ridiculous. You fool. You gonna die. There's no such thing as an immortal. Yes, I know. <laughs> Never seen anything like me before. 
I was designed to surpass you in every way. Designed, were you? To be your death. Check. <laughs> A pistol? Did that? Jesus. Sarah Sunny. And now for our next trick, check out door number three. Kill him. They're already dead. Bye bye. Luke Valentine. It's I don't think it matters. Your powers are beyond even the highest category of vampire. Releasing control art restriction systems three. Two, one. Approval of Situation A recognized. Commencing the Cromwell invocation. Ability restrictions lifted for limited use until the enemy has been rendered silent. Bruh. Bruh. Now, Luke Valentine. Bruh. It's time to educate you on how a real vampire does battle. <laughs> Ugh. Sir, don't run, don't be a bitch. I'm mad he's still shooting at you. You got that one leg, hop, bitch, hop. Keep, keep hopping, bitch. Don't, don't stop. See, if you kept going, you wouldn't got hit. Oh, wait, you have two arms, you can still make it. You walk down there, you can crawl back up there. With a zippity doo dah. Run, bitch, run! What are you? The what best vampire are ever, you? bitch. Come on, get up, attack me! You've only suffered the loss of your legs. Monster! Dog, you're a monster. Yo, bitch ass. Bitch ass. You bitch ass nigga. So, I see you for what you really are. Bitch! You're pathetic. Nothing but a useless He said he smells pussy. <laughs> you're nothing but the housing family toy. A dog for the Church of England, not even fit to call himself a vampire. A Silence! <laughs> I'm a dog. Then you're dog food. <laughs> <laughs> Got that piece too. All you had. <laughs> Honey, you're a vampire, sweetie cookie baby. My men. They've turned all my men into ghouls. <laughs> you is a vampire. You is a vampire. Me fucking live. See, I so fucking told you. <laughs> well, since I'm fucked, how about I piss a little wisdom on you, dipshit? <laughs> you can take this clue and shove it up your ass, bitch. Beware the millennia. Well, then. Hmm. Huh. Damn, that's a lot of people she got to kill, Walter, and that gun does not have enough. Find out about this millennium. I expect you to work quickly and thoroughly. Yes, of course, sir. Out of the ninety-six members of the Helsing organization's headquarters in London, only ten are left. Damn. Eight of which are only alive because they were away at the time of the attack. Damn. Excluding them, the only survivors from this ordeal are myself and you, sir. 
Hitler's Germany. The Millennium Order of the Third Reich. Is that really what it is? I don't remember this. All is well, gentlemen. The experiment can move ahead. Oh, wow, that's it? Oh. I don't remember that. My gosh. Now, I do remember this fight, and I remember those two villains. However, I don't remember it being like the Millennium of the Third Reich. Sorry for the yawns. It's kind of late, and I've been drinking, so that makes me sleepier. But I have no idea where they're going next. I honestly don't know. Because I feel like this was the end. I literally have to look up the first Helsing. Because I don't remember anything after this. I remember those two villains. I remember Alucard showing his ass and being like, Ooh. and I also remember him transforming into a dog. But I don't know which fight that was. I think it might have been the second fight with the um, Irish priest, but I, I this has been such a long time since I've seen um, Helsing that from here on out, I don't know where they're actually going with the information they're giving us. Um, I can't believe they wiped out everybody and the only people who were alive were the eight people who were away. Holy shit. My gosh. So, on that note, guys, Thanks for hanging with me. Hopefully I will catch you in the next one. Bye. So good.